New at 6, demolition of the second of four dams on the Klamath River is underway now. Four dams make up the Lower Klamath Hydroelectric Project. J.C. Boyle, Copco 1 and Copco 2, as well as Iron Gate. Crews already removed the Copco No. 2 dam. Now they're working to remove Copco 1 by the end of August. The Copco No. 1 dam has blocked fish passage for over 100 years. Deconstruction involves repetitive drilling, blasting, and chipping. The spring runoff period will not impact work because Copco 1 is a concrete arch dam that allows water to safely pass over the partially removed dam. It was really inspiring to watch this blast and moments after the blast to see the water and sediment begin to come out from behind the dam. Uh, and over the course of uh, a week, uh, you no, know, we watched the process of the reservoir completely draining out and getting back down to uh, a river condition flowing in its natural historic channel. Depending on rain, work to deconstruct the Iron Gate and J.C. Boyle dams will likely begin in May. The removal of all dams is expected to be complete this fall in time for the fall run of Chinook salmon. The restoration of the former reservoir footprints is underway and will continue for several years until vegetation is successfully established and water clarity returns.